Yo, what is going on, guys? I'm back with a TV and movie podcast, and today I have for you. Oh, excuse me, I burped. Um, I got for you. Oh, that was embarrassing. I might cut that out. But anyway, I got for you a live feed update by Big Brother 24 season. Yo, that was the worst intro. But look, I got a live update, and a lot just happened, man. A lot just happened last night. Out as I was sleeping, you know, I had to rewatch the whole thing at work i don't care bro but look you know so man throughout this whole week pooch was a target but he didn't know he was the target at all right it wasn't until the final hour 3 a.m thursday that he got worried about him and all going home this week and so he's talking to Alyssa, and Alyssa kind of slips out like um the guys have an all guys alliance, right? Isn't it called the Oasis? And Pooch is like, wait, who told you about that? And and you know, it's it's, it's so bizarre, right? Because just out of like mid sentence, Alyssa exposes Pooch's whole game, and obviously Pooch's whole game was exposed by Monty, Kyle, Daniel, the three members of the um, Oasis Alliance that kind of went rogue and aligned with the girls, right? The only other people in the Oasis Alliance that are loyal are Turner and Joseph and Pooch is so out of the loop and he doesn't know what's going on so he gets word from Alyssa not really word but he he gets alerted from Alyssa that the, the Oasis Alliance has been exposed and everyone knows about it and so now Pooch is going around the house trying to figure out who told who what and which person in his alliance exposed it to Alyssa and man oh man oh man but meanwhile while that's happening we see kyle and monty talking to joseph cluing joseph in what's going on this week and saying hey man you know we got to get rid of pooch this on thursday right and they give like some weird excuse like oh pooch has been going around telling indy this when we had a conversation not to tell indy or whatever you know some some lame excuse saying yeah pooch just rambles and the whole house is against him why should we, us four, including Turner, right? Because Turner's not in the room. So why us four be the outlying votes to save Pooch when the whole house is against him? So they so they seem like they want to bring Joseph in and Turner, you know? So even though they've been lying to them this whole entire week, Kyle and Monty have been lying to Turner and Joseph, they're doing some damage control right now, making sure they're getting their asses covered in case Turner and Joseph win HOH by letting them know that their boy Pooch is going to be evicted on Thursday. This is what this looks like to me, which, what's happening. And Joseph is like agreeing it, like, yeah, yeah, Pooch, he can go a little bit of a firecracker. I can see why you guys are saying that and, and yada, yada, yada. So Joseph, you know, throughout this whole week was sticking up for Pooch and then his alliance members that he trusts a lot is saying, okay, it looks like it's going to be Pooch this week. We got to vote out Pooch. And Joseph is getting alerted this in the last hour as is Pooch getting alerted this in the last hour or two by a girl. So now Pooch walks in into the bathroom while they're talking about Pooch. And Pooch is like, hey, boys, I'm not too happy. I'm, I'm worried. I'm very worried. Somebody in our alliance has exposed our alliance. And they even know the name. And Pooch is like, like, the girls can think what they want about an all boys alliance. It's just the fact they even know the name that means somebody went in great detail exposing our alliance. And, you know, Kyle and Monty are like, oh, wow. And Joseph seems like the only person that's actually shocked by this news because this is news to him. He didn't know that the girls knew about the Oasis Alliance. Kyle and Monty did. So Kyle and Monty's like going along with it like, oh, I can't believe this is happening. This is crazy. And Joseph is like, you know, genuinely, he's genuinely like shocked, right? And... And it's insane. And then Amira walks in, and Amira, it's, it's kind of awkward because, you know, the boys are talking about the plan that's going to happen and how to how to adjust. You know, Pooch is talking about how to save himself, and then Amira just walks in. She goes to the bathroom, and she comes out, and then Amira, Pooch is like, hey, Amira, come here, listen to this. They know about this boys' alliance and this Oasis alliance, and, and you know, he's just talking and rambling, and... and it's crazy, like Amira's like telling him to relax and Pooch is like, I can't relax, I'm, I'm worried about this. 
Like, and he and he genuinely thinks he's gonna go home. But it's so funny to me that out of all the people that walked into the bathroom, Amira, who has been the first person that wanted Pooch out this whole entire game, and now Pooch is like trying to beg for her vote, kind of like. It's it's funny to me, and then we see Michael in there as well. And I'm thinking that at this moment, Pooch is truly worried. He should just try to like make a deal with all seven of them that are in that bathroom right now and be like, hey man, I will protect you throughout this whole entire game. And but it's like he's just preaching to the wrong choir. You know, he's not really preaching. He's just he's just letting everyone know that, you know, there's been a rat in the boys' alliance and you know that's not gonna really help his case. He should just be campaigning at this moment. And and you know he, you know, Pooch is so gun ho on trying to figure out who the rat was that it's just making him a bigger target because he's just exposing the alliance even more. He's talking to everybody like, I think it's this person. No, it can't be Daniel. No, it can't be Kyle. Kyle wouldn't do that. Kyle wouldn't be that dumb to talk to Alyssa. Uh, it's not Monty. I know Monty. I know Monty. He's my homeboy. It's gotta be Joseph. He thinks out of everybody, it's Joseph because he thinks Joseph goes around and talks to the girls a lot, which he does. But man, Pooch, Joseph has been the only person in your alliance other than Turner who has been, you know, be, sticking to you and being loyal, man. And it's unfortunate that, you know, it, Pooch is just blaming Joseph and he has no idea what's to come, man. And yeah, man, this is basically it. And it looks like Pooch's fate is sealed unless, you know, he, you know, promises people and the girls, you know, because they're in control this week you know since they brought in monty and kyle they have the numbers and then monty and kyle informed joseph and it looks like it's gonna be a unanimous vote man i doubt that pooch is gonna have enough pull to turn things around but man this has been a tv and movie podcast hope you guys like my update see you guys in the next video peace